Earlier this week, a composer whose music was used was to be used was forced to step down as well due to past bullying that he was boasting about. Clovis Casali, who's in Tokyo for us, tells us more about uh, these dismissals. Clearly, it's yet another setback in the build-up to these uh, Olympic Games. What's maybe surprising is the timing of this amount announcement on the eve of the opening uh, ceremony. Uh, the artistic director fired over comments he made back in 1998. At the time, he was a comedian. And in a comedy act, he dared to say, let's play Holocaust. Of course, uh, those words have uh, drawn huge criticism, uh, reports resurfacing. And now, and organisers of Tokyo's uh, Olympics uh, definitely didn't want to be associated in any uh, way to uh, Kentaro Kobayashi. Uh, that's his name. What's surprising also is that it's the second uh, resignation of a key player of this opening ceremony. Two days ago, the composer had to resign, had, well, had to step down. Also, he was fired over an interview back in 19, uh, back in the 1990s, where he explained, where he boasted even about how much of a bully he was back at school. Of course, uh, worrying news for organisers in these very unusual times here in Tokyo, with uh, the games that are set to officially start tomorrow.